What is up guys? It's Ryan with Practice Makes Perfection. I know it's been a while since uh, I've done a video. I've uh, moved my shop down to my garage. Hopefully uh, there's some kids playing basketball next door. Hopefully uh can't hear that, but I'm working on an enclosure. Uh, it's pretty big for my uh, CNC machine. But something that I wanted to make a video about was my new Monport 80 watt laser. Thing's a beast. Everything's kind of messy right now, but uh, definitely going to be making some content with this guy. But I uh, just wanted to give a quick little review. As you can see, I've been uh, doing some testing with uh, some pretty thick stuff. Let's turn this on. Oh. Turn the breaker on. Let's get back here. Sorry, I'm doing this uh, all candid. You probably hear my uh, inline fan back there. Uh, let's see. Back behind my compressor, I got my inline fan. I do have my compressor hooked up to it, but I didn't think the uh, the one that came with it was too bad. But uh. Yeah, Woo. that's the cooler back there. I got the, uh, I gotta adjust that thing. It's still in the, uh, the auto, or it's, I forget the name of the mode, but uh, it's pretty cool. Um, keeps it chill, you know, like, like I like to do. Hopefully not everything's too loud. Um, I don't even have my laptop, but as you can see, this stuff, uh, this is like some fence, fencing post. It's doing some testing. I took the honeycomb that came out, but I'm gonna be doing some more stuff here in the future uh, with this guy. I'll do a, once I get my garage cleaned, I'll do like a, Kind of like a full review. Now so I'm gonna start making videos with this guy. So let me turn this off. Maybe it'll be better here. Or back here, we can see I, I hooked up the inline fan. Come on, fast follow. All right, yeah, I got the inline fan. I took out the uh, the one that was in there. It's just hanging out in there. Let's open this up. Check out this monster laser tube that's in here. I know I got a bunch of stuff on here I gotta get off, but I've been trying to get my garage cleaned so that I can turn it into a shop here. But uh, this guy's a beast. And uh, I highly recommend these Monport lasers because uh, it, it like came ready to freaking go like I, I read I was on the fence on whether to uh, go with one of these because there wasn't much out there on them because they're kind of a newer company I guess looks like they just started selling them in like November last year but uh, I joined a Monport or not a Monport an Omtech group and Everyone was just complaining, this breaking, that breaking, all that stuff. But uh, I ended up going with this. And uh, after I ordered it, I they sent me an email. They're like, hey, join our Facebook group. I joined their Facebook group. And then like I was reading, like everyone on the Facebook group like has nothing but good things to say. So re highly recommend it. Like I said, everything came ready to go. Uh, it was really, uh, there was like a... Some covers over the uh, the lenses, and there was a sh like a string holding the gantry. Um, after that, I hooked up, had to uh, upgrade my license to a Rudia controller on Lightburn, but then like it just it just it just worked. So, just a quick video. Uh, I'm gonna start. I, I always say this, uh, but it's been like three months since my last video, but I'm definitely gonna start making stuff uh this summer so gonna be doing some stuff with my cnc and my new 80 watt co2 laser 
pretty excited. So if you guys want to see some more content with uh, either the Sane Smart um, Prover, which I just saw that they had a new upgrade kit. So I know when I first bought mine, it's, it's a 4030 and you could upgrade it to a 6060. Now I guess they have like a 100 hundred kit that just came out. It's like $500. I'm like, where was this thing after, you know, cause I kind of, you know, engineered mine, but I would have preferred to, uh, you know, use an actual upgrade kit, but it is what it is. But, um, yeah, I'm excited. I, I still have a lot of work to do on this enclosure and I still have some more stuff to learn, uh, with the CO2 laser. So, I'll keep you guys updated. Thanks for uh, checking out the video. Please uh, consider subscribing, liking, and uh, leaving a comment. Thanks, guys.